what is up mile high six here back again with a new video and i'll be talking about nba draft today raptors uh big big day for the raptors big day for the nba we got the draft and the nba they're going in the right direction you know unlike a league the nhl who's run by a terrible commissioner who's run by a bunch of pussies who um who have to bow down to NBC. Um, uh, NBA is up and running. And they're going to have a season. 72 games. I don't know like if it's going to be division based or whatever. Uh, conference based. But we're going to have. like we're, We got a schedule here for the NBA. And the draft is today. And I can't wait to watch it. I know my team picks 23rd overall. I mean 29th overall. I don't even know what I'm saying. Um. Uh, top picks are probably Edwards, Winslow, and, uh, I mean, yeah, Edwards, Winslow, and Ball. Uh, the Knicks moved up to get, uh, I think, a first-round pick, 23rd overall pick with the Jazz. And the Bulls are trying to move up with the Warriors uh, to get the second overall pick. And that's pretty interesting. I don't know. Maybe the Bulls want to get LaMelo to steal him from the Hornets because, you know, Jordan and shit. <laughs> wanna, I'll one-up Jordan. I don't know. Uh, but what I know for the Raptors is we need a center a point, or a shooting guard, depending on if we re-sign Fred Van Fleet um, in a few uh, days because free agency is on the 20th. It's in literally a few days. Um, yeah, two more days and we got free agency. So this is going to be big. couple rounds, you know, Raptors got a couple picks. You know, this is the first time we had a first-round pick since 2016, I believe. Or 20, yeah, 2016, where we got Yakko Pirtle and uh, Pascal Siakam. Obviously, we knew, we knew who was the better pick, Yakko Pirtle, because we got Kawhi Leonard from that deal. So anyway, I'm <laughs> just kidding. Uh, but but yeah, this is uh, this is gonna be a it's gonna be a draft for the Raptors. I don't even I don't know any of these other guys. I'm sorry, I'm not the biggest like basketball college basketball guy because I'm getting into college sports right now. I don't even know what team I should pick for college basketball. Probably the best, like, I'd pick for football. But, um, yeah, the Raptors need a big center or a four that can like, have some size. We need to add some size to the team because we're losing Marc Gasol. Uh, he's going back to Spain. Ibaka may be going elsewhere. We don't know. Uh, and, like, we got to resign Boucher as a backup guy. Like, we need to resign some bigs. And Van Fleet's a big question. I don't know, like, what guards are available. Tell me in the chat. I mean, tell me in the comments what guards we can, like, add to replace Van Fleet. And uh, Terrence Davis, man, uh, another guy that we possibly have to replace on the bench. He was undrafted last year. Um, plays significantly well for a rookie undrafted guy. Like, Masai, I hate. I don't like him because... Of the guy that he resigned last year, but Masai, he knows how to find diamond in the rough talent. He found Fred, he found Pascal, he found guys that built. He found uh, Norman Powell from the trade, I think. Yeah, we got Norman Powell uh, from the Knicks trade, I think. Uh, I think we got him from the Barnyardi trade or something. Um, and uh, yeah, Masai can find diamond in the rough talent, but. We'll see what happens in the draft. Hopefully, he f finds another gem. Last year's draft wasn't really that um, entertaining for me. For as a Raptors fan, we got this kid named Hernandez. He played a couple games. He's a D leaguer. He's a, like a two day contract player or something. Uh, Hernandez. I don't know what where we're gonna put him if he's gonna play this year. But I want us to draft a center in the first round and maybe a guard in the second round. We need to add some size because we're losing size. In this off season, and I don't know if we're keeping Freddie. We'll see what happens. Um, as for the other teams, uh, they're all gonna get better. The Nets, they want Harden. I don't know what's gonna happen. There's a lot, of, a lot of buzz in the NBA, uh, and you know I'm just excited for today. It's the draft. I can't wait. I'm gonna something to watch because no football on, so that's pretty cool. Um. And uh, it's going to be pretty exciting to watch this uh, the draft, see what the Raptors do, see what the rest of the league does. Um, and, yeah, I'm just excited. Uh, good luck to every team, uh, really. 
except the Celtics. <laughs> yeah, I still, I'm still mad about that, but you know, it was, you know, it was the team's fault. And, and good luck to, uh, yeah, good luck to the Orlando Magic, the Denver Nuggets, my friends' teams, and uh, not the Nets. I don't care, Alex. But uh, you know, yeah. So I'm I. I expect this draft to be pretty, uh, pretty entertaining. Uh, I like Le- <laughs> Ball, who played in Spain, I think, and then Edwards and uh, Winslow played in college. Winslow's probably gonna, Winslow could go number two overall if the Warriors keep the pick. If not, I think I don't know what the Bulls will do. But uh, yeah, other than that, mile high six ninety out. Peace. Those are my thoughts on the draft. What the Raptors should do in the draft. Um, you know, obviously I'm not like, I know more baseball, more football than, uh, hockey or, uh, NBA just, but I know my stuff (laughs) once in a while. I can get it right. But all I know is the Raptors need a center and a guard possibly to replace Terrence Davis and Van Fleet if necessary, but we'll see what happens. Um, comment down below what you want, who you want your team to draft. Um, I'm just, again, excited for the, the damn fucking draft. I can't wait. And let's see what the Raptors do. Let's see what the rest of the league does. Um, I want to see if there's any, like, big, like, actual player trades in the draft. But we'll see. All right. Peace. Have a good day. Go Raptors. Go Broncos. Uh, go Leafs. Go Blue Jays. Go Clemson Tigers. And just go life.